yes hello and welcome back to another video here on the channel our second park from our Cornwall mega trip holiday yeah we are holidaying down in beautiful Cornwall so we thought we'd hit up a couple of theme parks while we're down here today we have come to the Camels Creek Park Adventure Park Camels Creek yeah it used to be under the banner of Creeley's we actually did this park about six years ago when it was Creeley's um, I think they've expanded a little bit they used to have one roller coaster they now have three so that's good so yeah, looking forward to getting in here and bringing you guys a vlog. I don't know much about the place really. I have watched a couple of vlogs recently and it looks pretty decent to be fair. We did do Flambards on Wednesday, go check that vlog out. That place was really, really good, just really, really busy. And I'm expecting the same here to be honest because it is the, the six weeks holiday and everywhere is uh, uh, rammed. Yeah, we've had some severe weather in Cornwall. We, um, we had a storm the other night in the caravan. Really, really good experience actually being in a caravan listening to a full on thunderstorm. At one point, I thought the caravan was going to tip over. Libby's here. Help me, I can't get my jumper on. Hi, Libs. So, yeah, um, we went to where did we go yesterday? We went to the uh, where did we go? The gardens of Lost Gardens of Heligan yesterday. We've done an amazing rope bridge there. <laughs> oh. really nice little place actually really really good value too we did football golf where sadly um i lost i was third place sam won i have got a bad you ankle you lost. I came fifth. yeah uh i should be winning those kind of things though football was my game uh I, I was third i got a bad ankle though so that is my excuse so yeah we're gonna get in libby excited another theme park today camels creek park Let's get in, it's, um, it's not too bad, it's a little bit chilly, but uh, like 10 minutes ago. yeah, we're a little bit late. It's Bailey messing ago. around doing his hair and stuff. Right, we'll get you in and we'll, we'll see you in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, so, yeah, really looking forward to this one. Um, Bailey's kicking off, he's not coming in apparently, he's gonna sit in the car because. It, too cold. It's too cold, the idiot didn't wear a jumper. <sighs> I told him this. Right, yeah, so we will get in now. Camels Creek Adventure Park, really, really excited for this one. They've got a couple of water rides, free coasters. They've got a coaster just for Libby. It's the clown coaster. Excited? Yeah. Thank you. Go. No, this is no entry. Is it Rose? How do you get in then? Oh. Hi. Yeah, first impressions again. I do remember it very, very uh, spacious compared to Flambard. It's a bit more spaced out. They do have animals here and stuff like that. Um, we are going to go and do the new coaster for last year, I believe, which is called Airbender. I think it's just a Pimfari. It, it's the same kind of layout. It's a galaxy layout. Like the one you got at Clarence Pier, which is an SPF Visa. It's, it's, it's a very, very generic layout, but it looks, uh, looks really cool. We'll go and do that. Like I said, they do have three coasters here. They had the Clown Coaster, which was previously located at um, Oakwood Theme Park, I believe. So yeah, uh, apologies if I look tired. This holiday has drained me, not only financially, but physically as well. Um, but it's been fun, it's been fun. Oh my God, meerkats, Libby, look, meerkats. Hello, hello. Obviously this area is new, you can see it's still under construction. Sam said to me, is this a new area? I said, yeah, he said, you can tell because obviously they're still digging it up. But uh, Sam said, this isn't the kind of park for us. We're all too old to be here. I'm like, no, we're not. I love it here. I don't care if it's a kid's park. There's some uh, really good rides here. So um, I'm excited to get in here. Libby's excited. We're not too old, are we, Libs? No. Plus they have like loads of animals, which is awesome. Meerkats, stuff like that. They've got like ponies. One thing I do remember about this park from six years ago, they had one of those vertical drop slides. I think it was called Demon Drop Slide. It's bloody brilliant. Bloody brilliant fun. Scary, but brilliant. Right, we'll take you on the, uh, the Pumfari Airbender. Do it. Did it do like the 
Yeah, Bender lives. Excited? Yeah. First coaster of the day. Three coasters here. Three. That's pretty awesome, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, there's loads of people coming down now. We we got to this one first because I'm guessing Hello. this will be the biggest queues of the day. Yeah, I like the Hornet at Flambards. Yeah, it's not as busy as Flambards yet, is it? Yeah, because it opens at 10, it's just like 20 past 10. Something. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Right, let's go. Are you going to come back now? What are you doing? Now hopefully after we um, finish it, Camels Creek, I don't think it's an all day park, I think we might be three or four hours. I'm going to head up to Springfield's Pony Centre, about ten minutes away. Apparently they have Mason's Fun Fair there, and they have a ghost train, so I might go and just check that out. I'll take Libby in, me and Libby will pop into that one. Yeah, they've got a ghost train, we're we'll definitely going to go and check it out. But they might, I don't know, we're, we're going to have a look anyway, it's like ten minutes away from here, so it's worth checking out no matter what, isn't it? Yeah. And they got ponies. Yeah, you ponies. We're next. Yay! Hey! 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 I wish they were as enthusiastic as I am. Here we go then. Oh, no. oh! Airbender Libby. Uh, Camel's Creek. Camel Creek's new coaster for last year, I believe. I don't know where it come from, but here we go. Lift it. Oh! Yeah, very similar to like what they have at South Sea, isn't it? So it's going to be rough as toast. I can feel it already. A nice little coaster for a park like this. Here we go, then, Libby. Old tight. Some beautiful views there. Yeah, very, very similar. You come round to a drop. Libby, nervous. The whole area is under construction. You, you can see. Old tight, Libby. That's not rough at all, that drop, smooth. Really enjoyed that. And here we go again. Another drop. Oh! That's not too bad, is it? Here we go. Get a bit, get a bit of speed on. Up and over the uh, station. There we go. Trims. God, I sound like a roller coaster enthusiast. <laughs> oh, sharp! And again, sharp! Oh! <laughs> he did warn us about those uh, brakes. Into the station. Oh, another brake. Where are they? They're there. They're going up. Mummy's going up. Oh, that was good. Really enjoyed that. Oh, there we go. How's that? Good. You enjoyed that? Good. Airbender done. Yep. Good. So you go, that was the, the airbender, the, um, I think it's a Pimfari, but Sam just come off and said uh, it's rough. It's not too bad actually. It's not, uh, it's not is it? I think because me and Libby ride a lot more, we're used to that, you know, we're used to it, but Sam doesn't ride many coasters, so she might find it rough. But honestly, I found it fine. I think it's a really nice coaster. Obviously, it needs a bit of, uh, probably needs a paint, and I think this whole area is getting like a, a revamp because there's, there's some construction going on. But yeah, very, very, very good start. I really enjoyed it. I don't remember you were very, very little when I we was last came. Three come. years old. You were three years old. I'm nine. You're now nine. nine. She's a big girl nine. now. They got um, a five D. What? Nine day away to six is three, so I'm three years old. Quick maths. We got got a five D uh, movie called Mission Impossible. We got some animals over there. 
I'm trying to want to get around and get the coasters done because obviously they're gonna get the most queues. But we are now gonna make our way into I can see the clown coaster, which is like a little go gator, but hopefully I'll be able to get on it because those those creds and all, I don't count creds, but I, I want to get on it. Like I said, this got relocated from Oakwood. It was there when we went, but we never actually saw it. So nice little coaster. Yeah, it basically is a go gator, it's tiny. Um, hopefully adults can ride because I'll take Livy on. And they have another coaster which is to the, to, to the back of the park, I think. But early impressions are really nice vibe. We've got a little drop tower there as well we'll get on. Um, beautiful landscaping around the fields. That's the thing with the theme parks in Cornwall. They're all um, really picturesque. They're beautiful. Got lovely plants. Plantage. Right, we'll go on and uh, get on the clown coaster. If I can go on, if not, I might give the GoPro to Libby. Clown coaster time. We're on the uh, the clown coaster, Livy. Really excited about this the coaster I've never done. We are literally right at the front. This looks familiar. You go for a broken drum. Yeah, it was at Oakwood. Oh. We never actually did it at Oakwood, though. So. Oh. Yeah, it's basically it's got a little lap. It is basically like a little go gator, but it's fun. It's really good. Take you on for a uh, POV. Got a big clown right at the front, look. The clown's face right at the front. It's very similar to Libby actually. Danny, looks like you. Here you go. The two boys are on as well. Here we go. <laughs> Sam is sitting out on this one. Thank you. Why is your mum coming in? Stop laughing. Sam's laughing at me for going on. Libby, you gotta get on those creds. Yay! <laughs> there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, straight for the drum, Libby. Way. <laughs> That's actually awesome, I like that. There you go. <laughs> Believe it or not, this isn't the smallest coaster I've ever been on. <laughs> That's embarrassing to say, isn't it? Woo! Oi, Libby! What do you reckon? That's fun, isn't it? Oh, tight! Here we go, Libby! Ready? Another lap! <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's got to get a double thumbs up. Yeah. Uh, oh, really enjoyed that really smooth little coaster. Amazing. Geek shot. Look at that mechanism there. Geek shot. So that was the clown coaster. Um, I, I haven't got much to say about that. I thought that was really good. Just a, like a little go gator style ride. Very, very, very short, but sweet. You have like a. Ride ever. Don't say that. Don't swear. Um, had a, like a little drum section, like a little dark section, a tunnel, a hedgehog. I don't know. Um, I really enjoyed it. Livy loved it. Where's Livy? There she is. She's eating something. What are you eating? Sweets. Sweet. Awesome. Um, I like she didn't offer me any. I bought them for Cameron, Cameron bought them. Yeah, so um, very, very nice coast. We are now in line for Vertigo, which is the drop tower. I've actually done this one before, do you remember? 
this was here last time we came so what we'll do is we'll get in get in line for this Libby's coming on anyone else any takers just me and Libby again yeah yeah I have done this one before so it's not a new ride for me this was here six years ago I think it's been rethemed now rebranded it's called Vertigo but it looks good doesn't it if you didn't check out the Flambard vlog go check that out because we did the, the one there the big SBF Visa uh, tower Skyraker that was really good this one's only a junior one it's not very high is it but it looks good the one at Flambard's is bigger but this looks good I'm not sure if it rotates or not I can't remember I really can't remember anything about it but you were too small last time we come you're three years old so you wouldn't have come on this Yeah. Okay, guys. Vertigo, Libby. Vertigo. Let's take you on. Oh, there we go. She gets some beautiful views here. It's not the biggest one, but it looks pretty decent. Sometimes these smaller towers offer uh, the worst kind of bounce. Ready, Libby? Oh, there we go. That's not too bad at all, is it? Whee! <laughs> It doesn't spin though, it's just a, a straight up and down tower. Good, Libby. Not too bad, is it? No. I, don't know what the, whoa! I don't know what the boys are scared of. It's a nice little ride, this. Very, very pleasant. Not too bad at all. Mum. Don't feel sick? Huh? Now, if you didn't watch the Flambards vlog, Libby actually game over on the Hus Frisbee, didn't you? Yep. Yeah, Libby's second ever game over. Pass Frisbee. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Really, really good. Yeah, not too bad at all. A couple of minutes on there. Very, very nice ride. Um, at the moment, the park doesn't seem too busy. I don't know if it's because everyone's spread out. The car park had a few cars in. There was quite a few arriving as we come. We are extremely early. We are here for opening. We want to get this done and maybe head up to Springfield and check out that. Uh, like this park. Very, very good. Early impressions. Maybe thumbs up. One or two, double. Maybe approves of that ride. Awesome. There we go, that was Vertigo, the, 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 the drop tower, really, they, they, I couldn't get my words out then, I'm like, yeah, it's tired. like I said, I'm really, really tired, this holiday has drained me. Vertigo, the, the tower, I don't know who builds it, but it's very, very nice, a straight up and down one, very, very child orientated ride, no, no frills on that thing, but really nice, Libby enjoyed it, didn't you? Yeah. I think um go I don't know. I think down there, love, down there. I'm trying to I'm trying to remember from six years ago, like my way around the park. Don't we don't use maps on this channel because maps are for for amateurs. We just I wing it and hope that. for the best. We well we go now onto Swampy and Dina Land. Swampy and Dina Land is where we're going. This is a very, very uh family orientated park. Just wanna warn you now, no frills here, but we should enjoy it. I'm enjoying it. The girls are happy. Chocolate factory. This might not be the longest vlog in the world. There's, it's all quite compact and there's not a great deal of rides here. There is a couple of water rides we want to get on. Loads and loads and loads of kids rides. There's three coasters, but we are literally making our way around so quick. We're doing everything and we've not even been here half an hour yet. So the park's extremely quiet, which is it's good, good to see. Good for me, because we get plenty of rides in. Right, they're running off.
Right, they're running off without me because I'm vlogging. Oh, I see the log flume. Uh, not the log flume, the dinghy right out there as well. Then the log flume. Walk on rides. Walk on rides here. <laughs> Livy, excited. Thank you. It's a dragon, Livy. I've actually got this cred, believe it or not. I did do this last time. Yeah, I've, I've actually got this, this coaster cred. I've done it before, six years ago, when you were a baby. Three years old. Six years ago, mate. I don't remember six years ago, but kind of everything's a blur, comes of old age. But yeah, we are gonna get on it on it now, and that's all three coasters done within, what, how long have we been here, half an hour? Pretty much done all the all the major rides, so awesome. But a lot quieter than Flambard's was, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that place was rammed. But um, we're enjoying it so far, aren't we? Six. Here we go then. I'll get a bit of a fried and then we'll be on the next train. Happy days. I'm I'm loving it so far. I'm absolutely loving it. Walk on cues. Ideal. Right, we'll be on the next ride. Looking forward to this one. Um, yeah, we've got Cameron and Libby. The other two are sitting out. They're miserable. They are miserable. What are they? Miserable. Miserable. I think Airbender give Mummy a game over. Yeah. Do you reckon? Definitely. Right, we'll take one. There we go. And the sun's coming out. The sun's coming out. I love it. Yeah, there we go. Nice little coaster there. So, like I said, it is a kids coaster, so don't expect massive thrills or speed. Saying that, that's quite quick. I love how low to the ground you get with that. Oh. That's nice, isn't it, Lips? That's good. Honestly, don't let the, like, the looks deceive you. This isn't rough at all. It's not as rough as it looks. And you get a bit of speed around this section. Here, low to the ground, look at that. Here we go. That's it. Two lap special. That is, uh, that's good. I really enjoyed it, did you? Nowhere near as rough as it looks, off ride. Enjoyable, very enjoyable that. So that was the coaster, I'm not going to even attempt to pronounce it, but very, very good, like I said on the ride. Do not let looks deceive you. That was an incredible, uh, incredibly smooth ride. Very, very nice, really, really enjoyed it. Great uh, family coaster. So I did do that six years ago. Really, really, really impressed with how smooth that was. Definitely, probably the smoothest of the three coasters here, but I still preferred Airbender because it's just a little bit bigger. You get a bit more of a drop. We're gonna go and look at now the, what's it called? The um, the log flume ride. I don't know if I can take my GoPro on. I think you have to use two hands to hold, but I will definitely, definitely try. And then we've got a log flume 
just here, which is called Thunder Falls. Should we do the log flume first, actually? I might do the log flume first. It's just here, it's called Thunder Falls. It looks like it's got all new cladding, like a new build there, all new wood. It's very, very nice, actually, very, very fresh. I think this park recently got taken over, so I can see some kind of improvements already in the place. We have new signage, new fencing, new buildings, so I think they are trying to do this place up. So we've got Thunder Falls, we'll get on now. Oh, beep beep, out of the way. <laughs> so we're not going to do Thunder Falls because you have to walk all the way around. We are going to do, um, hang on, Raging Rivers. We're going to do Raging Rivers, which is their, their rubber dinghy ride. Basically the same as they got at Poulton's Park. It's a generic rubber dinghy ride. What's, what are we looking at? Pigs. Oh my God, it's a pig. Oh, look. Oh, he's lovely. Raging Rivers, just me and Cameron. Again, like the Flambars vlog, bro. It's just me and you for the water ride. You don't really get wet on these. God, I don't know if I'm cut out for these stairs, though. I don't know if I'm cut out for these stairs. There's that coaster, Morgua. Oh my God, look at the queue. This definitely isn't walk-on. It got a queue. Didn't expect that. Ready? Here we go. Here we go, Cameron, no! Cameron's winning! Oh. Cameron's winning! Oh. Woo! Winner! Oh. <laughs> Cameron won, I think. Chia. I slid the furthest, so that should count for something, right? I got out first. Look at him walking like a penguin. Yeah, because he dropped you first. I saw you did it first. Look at him bickering. Think about who won. You'd think he'd let a child win. I've seen a pony ride up there. So we just come off the, um, what's it called, Raging River, the dinghy ride. That's probably one of the best, the best version of that I've ever done. Oh my God, you need to film me coming down here. Yeah, exit only it says. So yeah, now we are going to go on the, uh, the proper log flume, which is called, I don't know, I'll get confused with all the names. Raging River is the dinghy ride. So um, this is Thunder Falls. There we go. We are going to go on Thunder Falls now, which is the, this, the double drop special log flume. We're going to get soaked. I think it might be me and Rue for this one. You coming on? I'm going to be going solo, but it looks like an absolute soaker, this. Um, it is walk-on, there's just empty boats going around, so I'm loving this park so far. Six weeks holiday and walk-on rides, you cannot beat that. Really, really, really good. Got a pirate ship, pony ride, waves for it today, loads and loads of rides. I'm loving it. Oh. Honestly, in terms of like, getting on rides, I did not expect uh, to get this many rides in. Right, we're gonna go and get on Thunder Falls, he's coming on. We gotta try and find the entrance first, I don't know how you get onto it. Thunder Falls. Oh, uh, we'll do the pirate ship first, as it's right here, then we'll get on Thunder Falls. Um, I, we gotta try and navigate the, the entrance, we, we haven't found it yet. Oh my God, the sun's coming out. The weather has been on our side. Whenever we've been out for a day trip in Cornwall, we've had amazing weather. Yesterday we did Lost Gardens of Heligan. The, the weather was amazing. We went down to, where did we go? St. Austell? Yeah, Charlestown. Charlestown Bay, uh, where they filmed what? Poldark yeah. for Sam. See what to do that. Then we've done the amazing fo Cornwall football golf. So we had a really, really busy day yesterday. And the weather was amazing. So now we're going to go on what's called Pirate of the Seven Seas, which is the, um, the junior 
junior pirate ship. Um, I'm going on. Right. See you in a minute. What are you doing? Katie. I don't want to, to get <laughs> nailed by some little person. It's like death. <gasps> oh, Here we go then. Pirates of the Seven Sea. Like I said, all oh, this is new. They've added in little bits of theme in here, like Jolly Roger. Um, it's nice, very nice. Really impressed with the way this park looks like it's going. And again, another awesome bit of theme in there. Just to add so much to add this, this bit of theming around. So, where are you there? Yeah, like last time we come, it, I wouldn't say it was run down, but it wasn't as nice as this. This, since the new ownership, um, it's looking great. And again, another pirate there. It's called the Viking Warrior there. What is, well, I don't know what this supposed to ride's called. It's got two different names. We'll just call it Pirate Ship, shall we? But how are you finding this park so far? How would you compare it to Flambard to the other theme park in Cornwall? Would you like better? What do you prefer? This. Yeah. No, because it's not busy. I think you've, you know, you've hit the nail on the head there, Libs. It's not busy at all here. Well, we could, the queue is really long. Is it? Earlier. That's what I mean. That's why we like. There we go. There we go, Libby. That's not too bad, is it? That's all right, that one. I never said it was bad. That's just someone who didn't want to sit at the back, though. Yeah, Cameron did actually bail on this one. He said it. Um, he said it'd make him feel sick. Nice shoes there. Just the park in general. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Libby, you look like you're absolutely loving that. Whee! Yeah, like I said, it's only a junior one. It's like the one at Adventure Wonderland, isn't it? A junior, junior pirate ship. It's nice, really like it. And again, walk on rides. Walk on rides. That's it. Very short cycle, but happy with that. I was starting to feel sick. <laughs> Done. Hold tight, there she goes. Double thumbs. Yeah. So me and Libby have just done the pirate ship. Um, I don't know what it's called, it's got two names, but we're just gonna call it pirate ship. <laughs> Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Very, very nice there. Again, it was like I said, it's, it's a family, it's a family ride. It's a family. Stomach. Yeah, it did. It, did. it still had a bit of a kick to it. It didn't make your stomach go. Thoroughly enjoyable. Really, really like that. I am now going to try and find the entrance for the um, Thunder the Falls log flume behind me, and then we've pretty much done everything in the park. There's some animals to see. No, actually, we we haven't. We have a pony ride to do, and a wave swinger up near the entrance. We do have a 5D film. We're probably going to get some lunches. So the day's not over yet, even though we have literally done everything within the hour. Done really well today, really, really well. We can walk around and do it again if the queues aren't too big. Let's find the entrance for this beast, which is a two drop special. Enjoying it, Bailey. You're not enjoying it. So we're, st <laughs> we're still trying to navigate the log flume entrance. I don't know where we're going. It might be shut. That's why the boat, uh, there's just empty boats going around. I think the entrance is where we were originally, but they had a chain across because it was shut. 
Yeah, I've seen no one go around. They are just sending empty boats. So maybe there's like a technical hitch that we don't know about. Um, yeah, that definitely is the entrance where we were. So we basically walked all the way around it um, for nothing. Can we do it for you guys? Pony Express. Yay. We doing it? Right, we are going on the pony ride. Don't shame me. Um, you see quite a lot of travelling models like this. Uh, really, really, really. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to like, I'm trying to convince you all that it's cool to go on a pony ride. It's not. But I've got a daughter who likes them, so I'm going on. Um, Aaron, love, you take my bag. I'm going on the pony ride. If you laugh at me. Don't care, I'm going on. Here you go. Is this the coaster cred? Yeah, we are on the pony ride. I did do this on my own six years ago. There is a, um, a photo circulating on Facebook with me on this. No kids. I look like a right idiot. <laughs> I do like a good pony ride though, Livy. And they actually have sheep and up and... Uh, what? What am sheep. I saying? Sheep. They actually have sheep up in that field. I think I'm so tired, I can't get your words out today. You woke up at 5 a.m. this morning. I know, I've been up. You tried making breakfast. I can't sleep because all you hear on the bloody caravan roof is tippy tappy tippy tappy <laughs> seagulls. <laughs> Doing my head in. And you woke me up this morning by the fire alarm. Oh yeah, because I... <laughs> Sorry. The fire alarm went off like 10 times. I was cooking bacon and eggs in the caravan. I had the door open every window and it kept, we kept setting the fire alarm off. And there was me just waving a towel in front of it. I was trying to cook us all a nice breakfast. And I woke the whole uh, caravan up with the luckily, smoke alarm. <laughs> we managed in the end. <laughs> we managed, didn't we? We done it, we sorted it out. We had a I, nice breakfast, didn't I we? I had an egg sandwich. You had an egg sandwich. <laughs> Wait, you set the fire alarm off. I like, did indeed set the fire alarm off. Like six, seven times. I know. These caravans aren't very well ventilated. And it woke me up. I was cooking up a storm, Libby. Oi, but it, this is a lovely little ride, isn't it? Really nice, really... Um, it reminds me of... What's the one at Poulton's Park, the George ride? Yeah, the George's George... dinosaur. Yeah, it's basically the same, isn't it? Just ponies. Just ponies instead. I prefer dinosaurs. You prefer yeah. ponies, probably. Probably, yeah. I'm getting like a face full of hair. Look at this. <laughs> we had a storm in the caravan Wednesday night, and it's beautiful lay there listening to it. Really, really nice. I did fear for our lives at one point when the caravan thought it was going to tip over. But in terms of days out, we've been so lucky. We haven't had many beach days because of the... Um, I didn't hear the storm. It's not been hot enough to go to the beach. We did get a sunset evening where we walked to the beach. We are a five minute walk away from the beach where we're staying, which is why we stayed in Crantock Beach, the location. Really nice and we did get a sunset there. Beautiful. But, you know, we were hoping for one more beach day tomorrow and then we do travel back Monday. So Libby, hopefully, fingers crossed, beach day. There's everyone there. Just looking at me like I'm some kind of idiot. Hi. <laughs> Hi. I want to get him in a little Say woo! <laughs> woo! <laughs> so we've just done the pony ride there. Uh, really, really enjoyable. Libby was just telling everyone about the story of me setting off the smoke alarm oh. eight times this morning cooking fry up in the caravan. I'm um, yeah, sorry for what I, I tried to make a nice breakfast for everyone and ended up waking everyone up with the fire alarm. Sorry. So now we are going to Thunder Falls, the double drop special log flume. Am I on my own? Who's coming on? Cameron, yeah. you're my log flume buddy. I should come on, Jelan. Yeah, come on, come on. I need someone to go on with. Me doing rides on my own at this part looks a little bit suspicious. Don't call me that. <laughs> Hopefully you didn't hear that. I'm not going to repeat it. Uh, so we'll take you now on Thunder Falls, but we're having an amazing day here, honestly. Really, really enjoyable. Oi! They're picking on me over here, they're picking on me. Well, I'm taking you on. Hopefully Sam will get me coming down the drop. She's my off-ride camera girl today. I think she's doing a cracking job. I don't know. Here you go, love. No, she's not taking the camera. Soap what? What are you filming? Soap dispensers. The soap soap. No, I'm not. Thunder Falls, we're going on. Libby's coming on the log flume. Bless her. Here we go. Like I said, all this smells new and looks new. You see they're in the process of painting that up, look. Got LED lights on the roof. Nice, isn't it? 
I love the smell of light wood. Bit of a key, not too bad, not too bad. Take you on. You regretting your decision? You're not going to get that wet. I don't think it's a soaker. Those people look fairly dry. So that was a soaker. <laughs> and it was raining when we were on it, remember? <laughs> Here we go on Thunder Falls, Libby. I think I've done this. I think it's been relocated. It was towards the back of the park when it comes six years ago. If not, it might be a complete um, new flume. I am not sure, but I'm pretty sure it's been relocated. I, met, I remember the metal structure. Excited. But you can see all, the, all this is completely brand new. It smells new, it's getting painted up. Really, really nice. So I like the way this park is going, I really do. Right. We'll see you when we're going up. Could be about an hour. <laughs> One hour later. Still going. How long? Ten minutes? We're going up now. That's probably been about ten minutes. Here we go. Ready? Oh, here we go. Oh, Libby's at the front. She's going to take all the... Uh, she's like my umbrella. She's going to take all the, um, the moisture. Oh my God, this is steep. I'm going to go towards the back of the boat, Liz. Slide down, Liz. Slide down. Oh, how close is it? There we go. Why are you, you going to Here we go then, on Thunder Falls. Like I said, it is a two-drop special. Here we go. Remember the rules. Scream as loud as you can. Scream as loud as you can. Ready? Oh my god! Oh, you wet? Oh my god! <laughs> Look at you, you wet? Yeah. Look at that. That is a soaker. That's only the little drop. Here comes the big drop. Oh! oh Here we go. <laughs> Luckily the sun's coming out. Oh my. Do you regret it? <laughs> I think Libby regrets her decision. I don't, that was really refreshing. It's cold. It's not cold. Don't be silly. Oh, 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 oh. It's a really high flume, isn't it? You're really high up here. This is a, this is a massive drop, Libby. You're going to get soaked. Oh no, no, Libby, because you'll slide down. You've got to come back. God. Libby doesn't know the rules of a log flume. You'll fall out. Some beautiful views here with the Cornish countryside. Hold on, Libby. Oh my God. Whoa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so I mean about sliding forward. <laughs> How was that? That's an absolute soaker. I've got a bit of, bit of uh, a bit of wetness, not too bad. Libby took the brunt of it. Libby took the brunt of it there. Awesome stuff. Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! As you're right there. I'm soaking. You wanted to come on. I didn't force you. <laughs> I wanted to come on. Yeah, that was uh, brilliant. I'm just moist. Oh, so moist. <laughs> so we just come off the log flume there, Thunder Falls, really, really good. Um, someone's hat's just flown off on the ride and it's landed on the, um, on the drop. They ain't getting that back. What's the rules? Secure all loose articles. It's like, you know, they tell you before you go on. Right, Bailey, explain to the people why you didn't go on, why you chickened out. I'm not, I'm gonna get wet. You're already wet. You're wet. You're wet. You're a big, the weight of a car. Right. <laughs> right, Bailey, I'm going to smash the face in. 
Yeah. So yeah, I think we're now. I think everybody's um, was going to get a drink. So we've pretty much done everything. What's the time? We got here about ten past ten. What's the time? Forty past eleven. Forty past eleven. Is that a thing? Yeah. It Twenty is. to twelve. No, it's 40 past uh, 20 to 12, and we've done everything apart from the, the, the little chair plane. What? Can we look at the animals? Yes, we can. We're going to look at the animals and get a drink. I've really enjoyed this park. Are you, Sam? It's cute. Yeah, it sums it up. It's a very, very cute park. Very yeah, children. Terrible, very cute. It's a cute park. Very cute. Very. No, it doesn't mean it's terrible. It means it's cute. Very, very family orientated, but uh, we're a family, so spot on. We're all trying to find this big slide. We all have memories of this massive, like, vertical slide. I can't be making it up because everybody remembers it. I swear it was this park that had it. It was called the Demon Drop Slide. It's like a just a massive vertical slide, um, a bit like the one out of Oakwood. You know that big? You can sit on the top and you slide all the way down. Um, we thought it was at this park. We hope it's at this park. It might not be at this park. I hope it is because it was fun. And Libby will come on this time because she was too chicken last time. We'll find it if it's I here. Was three years old. Really nice building this. Look at the chocolate drops going around the edge. Oh, I love that. Swamps chocolate factory. Swamps chocolate factory. Swamps. Shit. Do you want a teddy? Or like, you can get a swamp teddy if you want. I'll have a Fanta, please. Anything else? That's it, thank you. So a medium coat, Capricorn, medium Fanta, medium Sprite. Yeah. Shout out to John Osman. Capri Sun. Got a generic. Got a generic. So the big slide they had, which was in this building, has now been converted into a 5D film. That was the, uh, the, the drop tower in there, the demon drop slide, and it's now a 5D film. So no big uh, slide here. Very disappointed. Sorry for any wind noise. It's a bit windy here now. I haven't put my uh, my muff on, my dead cat. We are going to go to the Treasure Island Cafe now, get a bite to eat before maybe looking at some animals. Maybe going around for some re-rides. Loving Camel's Creek Park. Really nice park. Right, food time, I'm starving. Food, food, food. <laughs> food. Cornwall's only 5D experience. I don't know what it is, but 
we're getting in there. How was the 4D, 5D cinema? Amazing. Probably the best one we've done, right? Yeah. I've done, um, I've done the Angry Birds at Fort Park. I've done the Portland's Park ones. I've done the Marvel one at Madame Two Swords in London. So I've done quite a few of those, but they're 4D. Legoland, but you have to take Legoland. Legoland one, yeah, that's, that's different. That's different. That's a ride, not yeah. a film. Yeah. Yeah. So I've done quite a few like variations of them, and I think that is um, up there with probably one of the best. We are now head, heading into Pet's Corner, look at some animals. I'm coming. I'm coming. Put your finger in the cage. Oh my god, I want that grey one. Look, he's so cute. So we just looked at a few really, really cute animals. We're now going for round two on the Airbender roller coaster. So look forward to it. Um, after that, we've got a few more rides to do. We've got like the uh, chair planes. We have some big slides we want to look at. Kids carousel, so loud this coaster. And then I think we're gonna try and hit up Springfield's on the road. So loud. But yeah, that's, that's pretty much done and it's not even two o'clock yet, so had a really good day here. Really, really good day for rides and Libby's had a great day here. Really enjoyed it, haven't you? Right, we'll take you one. Round two. Just done Airbender for the second time. I just want to say the staff from there are great, really friendly, really informative, really helpful. Smiles, love it. I cannot recommend this park enough. I know it's a kids' park, but these are the kind of parks that really need your support. I love them. I really, really like these smaller parks. If you know, if you are coming to Cornwall, like I said, a lot of people head to Flambards, that is their flagship theme park. But don't forget about Camel's Creek Park. It's a very, very underrated park. And um, even though it is to the little ones, there's three coasters here, and it's just a really nice looking park, and it's a beautiful area. And if you go to Flambard, have fun waiting in the queue for like two hours. <laughs> yeah, I think we've just been lucky today with um, the queues, but really good park. We're gonna do Dizzy Dina, which is like the frogs. Ready? Dizzy Dina. Here we go on Dizzy Dina, Libby. Like Libby said, it's like a jump and smile. Oh, wow. <laughs> I thought these spun, but they don't. So it's just go around and up and down, like a jump and smile ride. Libby likes it, right? Oh, like this, Libby, ready? Up. Up, up and down. <laughs> hey, you got to make the most of these kids' rides, don't you? Nothing wrong with a kids' ride, isn't that right, Libby? Libby's my excuse to get on these types of rides. If it wasn't for Libby, it would be weird. It would be very weird, me riding this. <laughs> it's really good fun, actually. <laughs> oh, it really is. And the staff are great. Can, are you brave enough to put your hands in the air or not? No. Oh, Christ. Well, oh, there's Shizlet. There's Dina herself. <laughs> it's a lovely area though, lovely park. Really, really nice family orientated park. Oh God, Libby, this is good. I think you're struggling with my weight. We are on holiday. I have eaten a lot, but that's allowed. Holiday weight. That's all right. Oh, here we go then. Dizzy Dina. It is like a jumping tomorrow, isn't it? Very tame one, but it's good. Yeah, after this, I think we are going to hit up the um, little wave swinger thing. Yeah. Chair planes and that will be it. Then we're going to head to Springfields and have a look what they've got to offer there. Good. Single or double? Double. Double. There we are, folks. Thank you. you had fun. 
Yeah. Loved it. Thank you. So that was the little Junior Dina ride. I don't know what it's called. Dizzy Dina? Yeah. Dizzy Dina. I'm knackered though. I'm going to go back to the caravan and get drunk in Cornish lager. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Yo. Hello. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah. Are you ice cream? You hold it. You got a mug. What have you got? A mug. What? A mug. Wave rider. Yeah. Last ride of the day. In front though. Yeah. Got stables over there, Libs. Stables. Oh, stables. This is your last ride of the day, is it? Beautiful this is, really nice. I do remember doing this uh, six years ago, believe it or not. Really nice. This is the last ride of the day now before we head um to Springfields. Fingers crossed they have uh, some rides there, and I'll bring you a, a little vlog from that place. Yeah. Straight into this, look at that. No messing around here, straight into it. Yeah, I'm so impressed with this little place. Just been told we picked the right day to come, which is a Saturday because it is changeover day for a lot of people obviously coming on holiday here. Um, I'm so glad. Apparently Tuesday and Wednesday is like an hour and a half wait for things because it's character meet day, meet and greet. So I think we've done we've done well here coming on a Saturday. Brilliant. I think when you do have a quiet park, it just does really increase the enjoyment when you're not waiting around all day. Oh, there's mummy over there, Libby. She's out now. Well, uh, Oreo ice cream. Livy! Enjoying that. That was the um, the awesome wave swinger straight into that cycle. Very very good fun. It's a standard wave swinger. Got flat jacks stuck in my teeth. But really really good day here though. We are going to head now to Springfields. Uh, Libby's eating her Oreo ice cream. She's happy. And all the kids have enjoyed this place way more than flam bars because it's been quiet. We've just been told by the operator there that we've chose the right day to come. Saturday is changeover day for people staying in the local area. So. Um, we chose the right day to come apparently it's an hour and a half wait for the coaster and other rides like come tuesday wednesday the character meet and greet so we yeah, we smashed it we smashed it right that's it from us i think we might just take you and look through the the crocodile corner the reptile house but then well, then we are gonna be shooting off we had a really really good job done all the rides some of them twice and it's only half one yeah i really recommend this park that is sam for families really nice park we're not too old we're not too old, Sam. Don't ignore, ignore her. Yes, so um, make sure you come on a Saturday because it's quiet. Right, Libby, thumbs up. Yeah, don't come on a character day. Don't do it. Really good day, yeah? How's it all your ice cream, nice? 
It's all around your mouth, so she must have enjoyed it. <laughs> we'll see you in the next one. Bye for now. Bye for now. Rachel and Phoebe. <laughs> Oh, look, he looks happy. <laughs> Not now, it's time they stop stroking him. Oh yeah, if he's head bobbing or throwing himself at the glass, this is a sign of distress, so he's not playing. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey, look. <laughs> 